I decided to carve out a few days to spend down here to do some scouting for the Bassmaster Classic, and uh, it's important, you know. E even though I've been here before, even though a lot of the competitors have been here, it's important to get back and to kind of refresh yourself with the fishery, especially that it's a river, you know, and rivers change. You know, sandbars move around, trees fall, those kind of things. So to, to be able to get out here and spend a couple days, it's going to help me when the tournament rolls around. We broke all kinds of records here in 2009, um, you know, with attendance, and I really believe that the coming classic is going to break those records. So, you know, I, I think it's a combination of a few things. I think the market's right. You know, Dallas isn't far away. It's in an area of the country that loves to hunt and fish. Uh, but besides that, I genuinely feel that Louisiana and Shreveport in particular have the most hardcore bass fishing fans in the world. And I'm serious. I've been all over the place, but. You really feel it here, you know, at, like I said, at launch, at weigh-in, you know, even if you run into fans out at, at dinner, you, you kind of feel the love, and that's that's special. You know, unfortunately, uh, a lot of people think luck is involved in fishing, and uh, that's not always the case. I mean, you know, most of us are out here working real hard, and fishing's a science, you know, and when you, when you understand fish behavior, and when you understand how they move based on seasonal pattern, you tend to do a lot better. So, you know, it's not coincidence you see guys like Kevin Van Dam and Skeet Reese and those guys always winning. Uh, they're not lucky, they're good, and they know how to use their equipment and know how to find fish. Yeah, you know, that's the great thing about the sport of fishing is uh, I, I think you don't have to fall into one stereotype. You know, I'm, I'm from New Jersey. Um, I used to break dance when I was a kid. I love rap music. My back's got a lot of tattoos on it. I mean, I'm not, not the typical fisherman, but that's the neat thing about the sport. You can be from, you know, any age group, any nationality, any background, any part of the country, and you can succeed in the sport. And uh, I love it. At the end of the day, it's you against the fish, and that's the competition.